just YouTube. <laughs> I'm sorry, I had to say that. So, yeah. I need to start a band. I already have like over 50 songs, no band. Suck. No, I look retarded doing videos and stuff. Alright, here we go. So, yeah. I guess so much inspiration from bands and just like life with my songs and I don't have a band. It's depressing. I'm gonna show you guys what my song book looks like. This is my song book. I've had it since senior year. The reason why it looks like this on the front is because I didn't like the original cover. Yeah. So, this is pretty much drawn to me. Woo. I had on like this really cool hat. Like, last month, and it's like a miniature top hat with like a little skeleton hand and feathers and like this thing, and like a fishnet covering face thing, and it's attached, everything is like attached to the headband. Fucking hat broke off, pretty much. And I don't know when I'm ever gonna go to the mall again, or if they even have those hats anymore. So, now I was going to use that hat for Valentine's Day, I'm not sure if I'm going to be able to now, because it's falling apart. I actually have it in my room, so I'm going to show it real quick. This is the hat. Here's the fishnet. I told my mom and grandma that I was thinking of hot gluing them, they said it probably won't work. Well, regular glue ain't freaking working, it's taking forever for it to dry. But yeah, that was my hat I was going to wear for Valentine's Day. Huh. In Valentine's Day, I got a math test. Yeah, no one's really that like, it's on a holiday. But hey, what can you do, you know? So, over 50 songs. I'm gonna start writing one called Fast as Lightning. And I pretty much don't know what it's gonna be about. Like, I think it's gonna mostly do with like relationships and stuff, or like running away from an enemy. I don't know. Or a crazy boyfriend or girlfriend. Wanted to. I don't know. But, um, I have some lyrics for my songs written on my bedroom walls. In front of me is Life or Death and Datara. Datara is based off the Naruto character Datara. It says, my heart knows I'm one with art. And do I, and life and death, the chorus is, part of the chorus is, do I choose between life or death? With that song, it, when, Someone is like at the middle of like hell and heaven, and they don't know where they're gonna be like going to. So that's what that song's about. 
Um, I'm Untitled in Your World. The song is called Untitled. That song pretty much is saying that the person is like an outsider, an outcast. They don't belong in anyone's world or life. Yeah, I'm putting my glasses back on so I can read more songs. Um, a zombie. The chorus is part of the chorus is "I'll be your zombie," and that's pretty much about a person who is in a relationship and they die, but they they can't leave the person they're with. So it's pretty much a zombie coming out of the dead world and going back to their loved one because they can't survive without them. Um, broken love. The part of the chorus is how did I come across broken love? I wrote that at my junior year talent show back in 2010 when I saw a guy I used to like and I was just like alright I'm gonna write a song about heartbreak. So um, forgive them for they know not what they have done. That's from the song Resurrection. If you're like into like church or anything, it's pretty much a line that the Lord said when he was being crucified and he was dying on the cross. Um there's this one song on my wall and I don't remember what song it is, but it says it doesn't matter if I look Oh man, I have my song book right next to me so I can actually find out. <laughs> oh, the song's called Wasted. And it's pretty much a song about people not wanting to be around anymore. And they pretty much figure that they lived for nothing. And they don't care they stay alive or not. Um, game of Perfection, the part of the chorus is let's play a game of perfection. It's pretty much about people who don't care about others and they think they're like one of those perfect popular people. And yeah. All I want to be all I want is to be accepted. The song is called this it's called Accepted. I wrote it for my little sister because she was having a hard time making friends. And I just wrote that song for her. Uh, this heart of mine is shattered. The song's called Shattered, and that's another heartbreak song. Um, my poor bones are broken, my body is ripped apart. That song is called, um, on it. I have so many songs, it's like crazy. The song is called Shattered. Wait, no. Sorry, my bad. I just feel like. Ooh. Looking for it still. Song. No, it's not protection falling off. Never mind. Okay, the song is called Broken and Ripped Apart. I actually wrote that for the character Naruto because he's always fighting to get to Sasuke. And he pushes to the limit where he's pretty much in the hospital. Uh, now I realize the song is called Never Mind. Not Mind. Mine, like, that's mine. That's m Yeah. Um, I saw it's pretty much about someone who finally realized that the person they thought was perfect for them wasn't really perfect at all for them. So, it's like a realization song of relationships. Um, to be honest, I, the part of the chorus is, to be honest, I never cared. That pretty much says that, um, one second. 
make it song because I could probably describe it a lot better. Older things, Army, Celsius, Starbucks. <sighs> Alright, so to be honest, it's pretty much happy that they're not with a person. Everyone kept saying the person would be so perfect with, and they're glad to be away from that person for good. That's what to be honest is about. And on the far wall behind me, not in, like right behind me, but on the left side of me, it says I'm dying on the inside. Um, I think that song is Bleeding. Yeah, the song's called Bleeding, and it's pretty much when a per describes when a person's like dying from blood loss and they're just like remembering everything in their life so that's I'm dying on the inside that's what it's called the, that's the beginning of the chorus to the actual song called Bleeding there's 51 songs written um I had to rewrite that one I wrote a song based off a pin I actually wrote, and there's a joke called That's What She Said, but I pretty much changed it up a bit and said That's What She Said is a backstabbing friend, so-called friend, and she just like backstab you, your friend, and if you have one, your boyfriend, and that she's not really your friend, after all. Um... Love, not war. Pretty much saying, stop the wars. Fighting isn't the answer to everything. Love is there. Don't fight. Um. The finale, I thought of that song as like, as if the world was gonna end for everyone. So that song is like, oh, we're all gonna die. Let's find a way to run against death and live forever. Um, unbelievable, I wrote for graduation. Pretty much saying how fast all the years went, and then you're finally. At the end of this, all four school years, and you're in front of a million or so families, and teachers and principals and younger siblings or students, and you're in the, your graduation cap and gown, and it's just about graduation. So that sounds special. So as I wrote the day of graduation, I was like really hyper off of a. Uh, Monster. I wrote a song based off of Twilight. <laughs> so it's a vampire song. Um, parental advisory needed is like video games, movies. And it's like almost like a recommendation song for like children and all. Um, the only present is a Christmas song. Christmas and love song. Very cute. <laughs> I never finished this song. It's called the texting song. It's like a bunch of like shortened words that people use to when they text friends and all. I wrote a song called Lost and it's like trying to escape fear but Fear keeps running after you and you can't get away from it. Um, uh, 
and I wrote a song for Halloween, it's called Halloween, and it's just pretty much people, like, going out, trick-or-treating, scaring other people, but it, this songbook has been around for almost two years, so this book is special, plus Jeffree Star, Javon Monroe, and Dozzy Vanity signed pages in this at Warped Tour back in July in Canada. Camden, and I took the pages on the book out for my scrapbook, so that's special. And getting ready to write my 52nd song, Fast as Lightning. I don't know what it's gonna be about. No, if it's gonna be like relationship or what. Um, leave comments if you think it should be like relationship, um, escaping an enemy. I guess what I was thinking about is like pulse, your pulse is racing from all the running that you do. Um, so it could be like, I'm probably thinking it should be like running from your enemy. Just let me know what you think it should be about. Title is Fast as Lightning. So. Hit me up about it. Um, comments on other songs. Um, just check out the rest of my channel, and hopefully, I'll respond to comments on my videos that you have left. So, peace out.